반갑습니다. A lot of people, when they come to Korea to teach English, at the end of their contract, uh, they decide that the experience was good enough for one year and they go back home or they go somewhere else, maybe to another country or something like that. And that's the end of it. Uh, maybe they can't wait for it to end, uh, so it's probably a happy time, or they just you know, decide that uh, it's, it was fun while it lasted. Uh, and I actually had somebody in my orientation class who at the end of the orientation, uh, they left. They went back home. Uh, somehow they decided that they had seen enough in two weeks or three weeks and that this was not the right choice for them for one reason or another, and, and they went back home. Uh, that doesn't happen a lot, but it has happened. Um, but then there's a group of people like myself who, after a year, they decide, hey, wow, this is a great uh, lifestyle or I really like teaching, uh, I'm able to pay off debt, whatever it is, and they decide to renew their contract. So somebody asked me, how many times can you renew your contract? Well, in the EPIC program, uh, which is for public schools, and I can't speak for hagwans. Every hagwan is different, and I've never taught in one. Um, so I can't speak for those, but in, in the EPIC program, as it stands right now, you can renew as many times as you want. Uh, in fact, I have a good friend of mine here who has been teaching in Korea for nine or ten years, I think ten years, um, and maybe six or eight of those have been in the EPIC program. So uh, as it stands now, uh, you can keep going as long as you want. And uh, my friend has no sees no end in sight. Uh, he's engaged, so it's probably a good idea if he sticks around for a little while. Um, so it's a little different than maybe uh, the, the JET program, which is uh, Japan's equivalent of the EPIC program. Uh, now the JET program, as I understand it, has a five-year cap. And after five years, that's it. If you like it or not, you have to go. Um, so it's good that you don't have that um, in Korea. I know a lot of people have been uh, mentioning to me, oh, I, I, I want to make it a long-term thing or something like that. And as it stands right now, you can make it a long-term thing if you really like it. Um, but things change every semester, so I don't know if that'll change or stay the same. But if you do renew your contract, it's a good thing. Um, and the reason is, when you fly here, you're given an allowance to pay for your ticket. And I believe that's 1.3 million, uh, 1 million won. Um, and I don't think it's changed. And when you leave, you also get 1.3 million won. But if you decide to renew your contract and you want to stay in the same province that you're in, they actually up that amount and call it like a bonus, like a re-signing bonus or something like that. And they up it to 2 million won, which is uh, a, nice little, a nice little gift, actually. Um, comes out to maybe 18 or 1900 US dollars um, now, if you go to another province, uh, you're going to only get the uh, airfare allowance that you would normally get, 1.3 million won. Uh, so that's why a lot of people stick around. When they do, they stay in the province that they're in because you get a little extra money. So that's an incentive to, uh, to renew your contract if you like it and to stay in the province that you're in. So hopefully that answers your question. Um, as a, again, as, as it looks right now, um, you can stay as long as you want. Um, if things change with the EPIC program, there's always hog ones. And I think over time, hog ones are going to grow just because uh, some of the jobs uh, through EPIC are beginning to retract. So you're going to, because of that, you'll see uh, probably more opportunities in hog ones. And, uh, but it all depends on how, how they run their particular school, <clears throat> if they have a, a limit to how many times you can uh, renew your contract. So that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'm going to go like this and point down. Uh, if you like this video and uh, you like the other videos that I posted, please subscribe. Uh, I get questions all the time, and I like to make videos to answer them. If you ever have a question, uh, please let me know. If it's a good question that uh, I think would benefit others in a, in a positive way, uh, then I'll, that I'll try to answer it as best I can on a video. Otherwise, have a great day. I'll see you next time. Peace.